Hello everyone, welcome back on my channel. Today we will see the scatter chart in Power BI Desktop and we'll understand it in detail what is scatter chart in Power BI and when to use it. So a scatter plot uses dots to represent values for two different numerical variables. The position of each dot on the horizontal and vertical axis indicates values for an individual data points. Okay, so it is basically used for the numerical variables. And uh, when uh, we have to use it, like when we have to show the relationship between two numerical values and to plot two groups of numbers as one series of X and Y coordinates. OK, then we are able to use it. OK, so let's see it in Power BI desktop. <clears throat> so uh, after clicking over here on this scatter chart, we'll get this visual on this page. And uh, we have to add the fields over here, okay, in this section. So in the details, uh, we can add the customer segments. In the legend, we can add the regions. And the x-axis, uh, we have to set the x and y-axis as a numerical value. So we are having the sales and profits as the numerical values. So we'll get that. And in the size, uh, we can add the product category. And in the play axis, uh, so it is the most important uh, thing in this scatter chart. So by using this play axis, we are able to set the, we can add the product container here. So we uh, will get this play axis over here on this visual after adding this play axis, okay? So after playing this particular play axis, we are able to see which product containers are showing the profit and sales. Okay. So after stop, we are able to see the sales and profit and count of the product category by customer segment, region and the product container. So this is the product container jumbo drum. Okay. Or we can add any other uh, field in the play axis and we can play this axis for that particular uh, categories okay so see this is like the most important thing in scatter chart and uh, we can format it by using this particular format op option so general region x axis y axis we can set the uh, particular size and all from there we can add the zoom slicer we can uh, like change the color of data we can add the shapes of that particular see uh, here we are having the circles we can add that as a square we can take the diamond we can take the triangle okay so after playing so it is showing us in the triangle okay and then we can on the category so that we are able to see the category name over there. We can add the color border also of that particular shapes from this option. We can add the title, background, lock. Uh, we can lock that particular visual. We can border it. We can shadow it. Okay. So in this way, we can create the scatter chart in Power BI Desktop. And... Uh, We'll see how to create the pie chart in Power BI in next video. Up to that, please don't miss to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can receive the new notifications of my upcoming videos. And uh, if you want to check, uh, like if you want to uh, explore the real time projects and the task in Power BI. So I have created uh, the three playlists for the beginners for the real time projects and the task also. So you have to check my description. I have given the links over there okay and uh, thank you for watching this video